I feel like I almost harmed my own family. We moved into our new home in Singapore, and just two days later, my family messaged me saying they felt dizzy and even had nosebleeds. At first, I didn't think much of it, but that night, when they ended up at the hospital, I realized how foolish I had been. When we were renovating, I had picked all eco-friendly materials and I even tested the formaldehyde levels. They were within safe limits. But when I consulted a professional, I finally understood eco-friendly just means the formaldehyde is low, not zero. Putting a few bowls of tea leaves or floral water, that does almost nothing. I really hope no family has to experience a formaldehyde tragedy like this. After that, we called professional formaldehyde removal specialists to do a full house treatment. For areas like cabinets, drawers, or bed frames, places that are hard to ventilate and easy to warp, they placed activated carbon to absorb the formaldehyde that couldn't escape. And once the activated carbon is full, you have to air it out on the balcony, or it will just release the formaldehyde back into the room. So my advice to every household is, before moving in, make sure you properly remove formaldehyde. Don't make the same mistake I did. Luckily, we acted in time, and now our home is safe and healthy.